Here's what's next. So we're going to be making the fixed margarita. We've got all our components here, but one of the first things I want to talk about is I want to talk about the most, the two most important parts of this margarita. One is the ripeness of the limes, and number two is using a high quality tequila. I like this Altos brand. I think it's a good medium price point. They make a good Anejo and they make a good Reposado. I like both of those because they have a little more uh, caramel in them. So I use those. You will hear people that will poo poo and say, do not use that quality level. I like it. Makes me feel like there's a little brown sugar in there. Then as well, we're gonna be using Grand Marnier. Grand Marnier and orange liqueur speaks for itself. Now, if you don't wanna pay the Grand Marnier price, you can use this Patron Citronage, which I think is pretty decent and fine, and especially great for making big batches. Now, I know you're thinking, why does she have such really big bottles? Well, I have margarita parties. And this video is for my girl Susie. She asked about the fixed margarita. So, let's get started. So here we are. We're going to start off with about four ounces of tequila. And this should make two margaritas for some people, one for somebody else. Then we're going to do two ounces of Grand Marnier. And then we're going to do like one and a half ounces of limes, which is generally about two ripe limes. Now again, because we already talked about our limes previously, look at the color. Now one of the things I want you to notice as I'm about to start, this is key. Do not squeeze the crap out of the limes. You know, sometimes you go and you get a fresh margarita at the bar and you're wondering like, hey. So what happened is not only did they use a lime that was not ripe, then what they did is they used the Super Hulk version. My son is like that. He's got big, strong arms. Sometimes he makes Hulk margaritas for me. So just be gentle, there's enough juice in them because see how ripe they are. All right, I'll rock and roll for this. Then what we're going to do is we'll add a little bit of salt. We'll add just a little bit of water to my cup. I don't like a lot of salt. We have some Himalayan salt. I just put a little on there. And that's enough salt for me. And I'll add my ice. Probably a lot of ice. Let's take one piece out. I want to feel like I'm at the bar. And then I use chopsticks for everything. So get a nice little mix. Pour it over the top. Add a squeeze of lime. And then the fixed margarita. And again, this is the bomb because the limes are so ripe. Yes. And excuse me for smacking. Psst. Hey, it's Courtney. Hope you really liked the video. Beneficial foods are part of my daily I love myself formula. They feed my body, hey, sometimes just my soul. See you next time. Please press the bell below, hit like and subscribe. Comments and questions are always welcome. And remember, maximize your joy because life is fun as shit.